The United Nations has announced an unconditional week-long humanitarian ceasefire in Yemen, where more than 80% of the country's 25 million people are believed to be in need of some form of emergency aid. UN spokesperson Stefan Dujaric says the truce would start today until the end of Ramadan. This is not open-ended. President Obama made it very clear to me last night. Uh, you can't wait forever for the decision to be made. We know that. If the tough decisions don't get made, we are absolutely prepared to call an end to this process. The United Nations refugee agency UNHCR says the number of Syrian refugees in neighboring countries has passed 4 million. Some 630,000 Syrians are now living in Jordan according to the agency. Many of the refugees have found their new lives a struggle as the agency says 86% live below the poverty line of $3 a day. Twelve migrants died yesterday when their overcrowded rubber dinghy sank off the coast of Libya, while some 823 were rescued in the latest episodes in the Mediterranean migrant crisis. Tens of thousands of migrants fleeing war and hunger in Africa and the Middle East have crossed the Mediterranean to Italy and Greece this year. Over 130 recently identified victims of the 1995 Srebrenica massacre were ready to be finally laid to rest yesterday when they were moved from a morgue and brought home for burial. Bosnia marks the 20th anniversary of Europe's worst mass killing since World War II, where some 8,000 Muslim men and boys were slaughtered by Bosnian Serb forces.